Hey guys, what is up? I'm Crisper, and today I'm bringing you some more pack openings. I haven't done one of these in a while, about two weeks or so. So, got a lot of information to fill fill you up, fill you guys up on um, about everything that happened this week. There's a new collection set out. Uh, the game week two. When I'm recording this video, it's week two just dropped. Uh, those are actually pointless collections because. Honestly, they're just completely pointless. Um, because why would you complete a collection for two grand when you can sell the card for like three? Like the Julio Jones, I think in week one I had Julio Jones and he was in it. And instead of buying the other guy for one thousand five hundred dollars and profiting five hundred dollars from a Julio, I sold Julio for three grand. So that's what I did. Uh, I got some new lineup changes for you guys. And oh yeah, the fantasy. What am I talking about? Fantasy came out. Uh, let's get into that. So what happened for fantasy? If you guys didn't know, uh, they had a collection that's near impossible to complete because I've yet to pull a fantasy card. I bought an old tree for cheap. And that's about it. My friend, I know a guy who pulled the Julio Jones, but that's it. Um, once you complete the collection, you unlock uh, a special challenge to get a boosted RG3 which I have no idea I haven't seen anyone with it yet uh, and to get uh, the last card for the collection the David Akers you have to go through a series of fantasy challenges uh, it's like I don't even know how many there are like 10 or something and, and they're not too difficult they're pretty easy I didn't lose to any of the teams from them so not too bad um, yeah that's basically it uh, I got, uh, my lineup's a lot different than it would be from my last video, cause I acquired a Darren Sproles, uh, because I think he's better than Marshawn Lynch, only for my purpose though, uh, he's an 89 overall, but he, I think he's a lot better than Marshawn Lynch, because the fact his speed and elusiveness uh, for how what I use I like to use the outsides a lot I like to pitch the ball when I do run plays and he's just deadly on it but he fumbles it a lot more I think I only fumbled it once with Marshawn Lynch and I've had Darren Sproles for like two days now and I fumbled it like three or four times with him so that's not too good I actually gotta hold on to the ball now and right there you just seen my David Akers that I acquired pretty beast and coming up is the Vernon Davis uh, coin up week two challenge along with the week one that I think I might have showed in this video not too sure but uh, this time you can choose between Vernon Davis or Calvin Johnson as opposed to just stick with your uh, Victor Cruz which is nice uh, you get two shots and obviously I'm gonna go with my boy Cal cuz Cal's a beast and yeah, how could you not take Calvin Johnson over Vernon Davis? Because the Lions have Beast D, that's why. Nah, I'm just kidding. I'm just, I'm so biased. I love the Lions. And, uh, yeah, so I took I took Calvin. Um, and they're coming up into my lineup here, so you guys can see, got some new offensive weapons. Miles Austin is replaced Julio Jones, because, like I said before, I sold him. Uh, I've got Darren Sproles I already talked about, and uh, Hakeem Nix, Dwayne Bow. they've been there for a few. Oh, Stafford, I picked up Stafford in replace of Cam Newton, Cam Newton did good for me. Um, defensively, we're pretty strong, and uh, we got some new, uh, we put Brandon Flowers, strong safety, acquired Tomba, Fletcher, Rhodes. Uh, Kevin Williams so we're looking pretty good our teams overall pretty beast hopefully you guys enjoyed this long uh, pack opening video drop a like if you liked whatever you want I don't care I don't care I'm Chris and I'm out peace